Hi, Chuck Huber here for the Stata YouTube channel. Today I'd like to give you a quick tour of the Stata 18 user interface. Stata's interface has an intuitive, user-friendly design that allows new users to quickly learn how to accomplish sophisticated data management, graphical, reporting, and statistical tasks. There are three ways to interact with Stata. The menu system and dialog boxes, the command window, and the do file editor. The easiest to use in the beginning is the menu system and dialog boxes. The menus are organized in a logical way to help you find the tools you need. And the dialog boxes allow you to select the options that are available for a particular task. If you would like to learn more about a command, you can click the question mark at the bottom of any dialog box and it will take you to the help file for that command. If you would like even more detail, you can click View Complete PDF Manual Entry below the title of the command at the top and it will open the corresponding entry in the PDF manuals, which provides more information and many worked examples. When we click OK or Submit, the dialog box will create the command for us, which lets us learn the new syntax quickly and easily. Once you are familiar with Stata's syntax, you may find it faster to type commands directly in the command window. And eventually you may want to collect your commands and batch files, which can be written and edited in Stata's Do File Editor. You can access the editor by clicking the New Do File Editor icon on the toolbar. Here you can add comments and save your commands so that you can, can replicate your tasks later. Once you give Stata a command, the output is displayed in the Results window in the center of the screen. We can also send our results to a log file by clicking File, Log, and Begin. You can see a list of the commands you have run in the History window, and you can rerun a command by double-clicking it. You can also scroll through the commands in the Command window by pressing the Page Up or Page Down keys, and you can even hold the Control key, select a group of commands, right-click and select Send to, Send to Do File Editor. You can import data that have been stored in a wide variety of formats, or you can open Stata datasets. After you import or open a dataset, the names of the variables will appear in the Variables window, and if you select a variable, you can view or edit its properties in the Properties window below. You can view the data by clicking one of the Data Editor icons on the toolbar. In Edit mode, you can modify your data in the spreadsheet, and in Browse mode, you can view the data safely without accidentally bumping a key and changing your data. The graphics dialog box boxes make it easy to create publication quality graphics quickly and easily. After you create a graph, you can click the graph editor icon on the toolbar and add text, lines, as well as edit other attributes such as titles and colors. The tables builder makes it easy to create customizable tables and export them to popular file types including HTML, LaTeX, Markdown, PDF, Microsoft Excel, and others. If you need help learning about a topic, you can click Help and search for topics. Or you can open the PDF manuals and browse over 18,000 pages of documentation organ organized by topic. If you would like to learn more about Stata or download any of our manuals, you can visit our website at stata.com. I hope this was helpful. Thanks for stopping by.